what is up, YouTubers? Johnson here, and welcome back to some more Firewatch. And uh, I'm here with the Butterfly Phil. Just you know, he's just flapping his wings around, all innocent. Meanwhile, me and Delilah are in some shit right now. So someone's following us and documenting our freaking conversations for the past two months, apparently. And uh, yeah, just some weird, creepy shit's been going on, and it's been only happening to us two, obviously. And um, yeah, it's it's. This is not really good. Not good. So, uh, we're trying to figure out the bottom of it. I am on my way to... Uh, I'm on my way to, uh, Whippy Station to, uh, break down the gate and figure out what's going on by Whip Whippy Meadow. So, uh, yeah, that's where we're gonna be going. But I also got a new radio. That is different from the old one because the other one was tapped. This one's a clean one. So now we cannot be, uh, stalked as much. But still, and, uh, that, that person that might have been, uh, watching us might have done something with those Mexican girls as well. You know, the ones that were naked over there earlier. Yeah, that... Might have done something. But, uh, yeah. Uh, let's see. Here's the path. Alright. This path should, uh, go straight to the gate. Actually, should I even go there? Sh shouldn't I just wait another day or something? Because, um... The sun is setting, and, uh, it's probably not safe to travel through night. You know, safety in daylight and all that. Honestly, I feel more safer during the daytime, honestly. In my case. Like, if it's nighttime, I'd want to get back to my freaking lookout as soon as I can. Unless I have work to do during the night, but, you know. <laughs> and you know what I said about, uh, this whole, like, working on this? Maybe I don't want to anymore. <laughs> Alright, let's, uh, fence. I'm busted again. There's nobody around, and it's the freaking way in. Copy that. Uh, read. Okay, Whippy Station uh, personnel. If you are trying to reach Dr. Simons, he is on uh, site from August 15th to October 15th. University owned equipment is the responsibility, responsibility of Dr. Johnson. Government owned equipment is under preview of Cav Fordanier. Uh, remember, this is a control area and any issue, malfunction, or violation should be reported immediately. But the, the 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 notepad. Excuse you. That's not what I was. Okay. I got an axe to defend myself. Oh, I don't like this. I don't like this one bit. Oh, I got to turn on my flashlight. Jesus, it's starting to get dark. Getting creepy. Getting absolutely creepy. Oh, I see something here. Should I smash it? I 
guess not. Okay, well, we're going to continue forward. Oh, I think I see a bigger sight. Hmm. I'm not gonna do the tower again. There's all sorts of contraptions and shit out here. Like what? Dishes and stuff, like metal legs. There's wires all over the place. I don't know. I'm not really up on high tech. What's that? Oh. What the? No, I missed the freaking report. Well, that sucks. You know what? Fuck your mug. Alright, let's... I found the main monitoring desk. Oh my god, what do you see? Seriously, at this stage, I believe just about anything. Jam? Fuck your jam! Oh, there's something else. Uh... Oh, I think I see. Oh, is that ever going to be recording? They're measuring the barometric pressure, too. Why? Maybe it's just a diversion. Maybe. I wonder where they are. All, all of their stuff is here. And they know you're there, so see what you can find and get out. I think I found the thing they used to track us. Holy shit. You know, you swear, like, a lot. Not the time, Hank. <laughs> anyway, it's called a wave receiver. Looks like it picks up anything that emits a signal. It's got basic orienteering capabilities, everything. Like, holy. Holy shit, Henry? Yeah, holy shit. You're gonna take it, right? Yeah. Of course, I just took it. Uh, okay, this thing is losing its mind, beeping like crazy. I can hear it. What, what's it after? I don't know. I'm gonna go find out. Oh. And the O. Are they writing a script? Oh, I should have read that, damn it. Can you hear me? It says that you, you and your boyfriend are still together. What? We're not. They're messing with us. Yeah. Okay. They are. How do they even know who he is? How the hell does this... I'm so sick of letting these people do this to us. We should just burn the place down. Think about it. Look, maybe that's what they want us to do. 
I don't know. Maybe they're trying to push us to the point where we do something crazy. If the grass is dry as hell here, it would go up in a second. Well, now I'm thinking, what if you're right? I, I just don't think we should do anything that we can't undo. Well, maybe it's not the best idea. Yeah, it's definitely not the best idea. We're fucking wound up. It's all right. I'm just going to hike back. We have the wave receiver, and tomorrow we can figure out what to do. I don't like that it's making me go back. Also, my foot's fucking asleep. Oh, God. I gotta go all the way back there? Uh-oh. Also, I like how my receiver's the thing coming up. Actually, wait a minute. Can't I... Wait, hold on. If it's... Oh, I could... Okay, so I guess we're gonna be reading this. A clipboard of the read. Uh, that's the one I read before. Good, I can actually read this stuff. Okay. Okay, so subject Henry M, age three nine, pro uh, program stats review, week one twenty uh, four six ten twenty five 6, 10, 25, annual. Uh, observation traits, comparison explorer keeps to the path, prone to anger, passive, guilty, uh, for, forthright, guarded, subject, subject has fully engaged uh, supervision, trust, that, trust yet to be significantly proven, all signs point towards full cooperation. Update, subject may be aware of, ta uh, of tests, Sub subject we discuss of subject uh, decided to leave his post. Uh, susceptibility to manipulation nine. Sign off, eg. I like how when we're in this, it, like the music just kind of bumps up. All right, Delilah. Uh, Whippet station uh, personnel. If you are trying to research Dr. Simon, wait. Did I wait? I guess I didn't read it. Okay. Subject Delilah A, age 43. Man, she's older than me. Um, Quarterum State is review, week 1, 4, 6, blah, blah, blah. Okay. Uh, observation traits. Uh, relatable, constructing al alcoholism. <laughs> uh, observation. Uh, selfish, stoop, uh, perception of personal history. Uh, person of oh, facts. Uh, never marry. No kids. Rarely hikes or leaves imminent surroundings. Uh, multiple lovers, despite long-time partner named Jeever. Susceptibility to manipulation is a three, so it's definitely different between both of us. Uh, sign off, EG. Interesting. Is there any way I can like switch this, or am I stuck with this? No. Okay. Interesting. Guess I can't even pull out my compass now. All right. Well, uh, let's try to head back. I guess. Ugh. Just get me out of here. Night is not a good idea. Oh, I thought... Is that light? I don't know, that might be because the sun is still setting? Yeah, the sun is still setting. Okay. Uh-oh. Yeah. We're 
talking about people watching us out here who are now burning the forest and everything in it around us. I, I, I don't know what to do about that. We just have to get the hell out. Yes, get us the hell out of here. I will. Day 77. Yeah, that's creepy, honestly. <laughs> God. Honestly, just the thought of people, like, stalking you and getting information out of you is definitely creepy. Ugh. Like, honestly, at that point, like, honestly, I'm still getting chills from this game now. I mean, I know I've played it a while, so I don't remember everything that happened, but still. <laughs> Still gives me the creeps at times, but I think we're actually almost done with the game. I didn't think it was actually going to be like five episodes. But hey, quick game, quick series, you know? <laughs> yeah, this would definitely give anyone, uh, like, who first plays it, uh, shivers down their spine for sure. Yeah, it definitely has, like, a nice little uh, story to it. It's definitely a very interesting story to go on. And when I looked at it at first, I thought there, I thought it was, like, scripts or something for, like, Oh, are they the creators of this game? <laughs> Is this a real-life event? I don't know. I mean, they can't talk in, like, through the radio normally, so, like, I don't think they haven't talked outside of the radio normally. I mean, obviously we haven't heard it from Delilah outside the radio, but like... Henry, on the other hand, we haven't really heard him out of the radio either. What does it say? Receiver. Oh, good, you're still here, Bernie. Yes, a toast! A toast! I would never leave you! Alright, anyways, um, I'm picking up something. Bernie? No, it's not you, Bernie. That side? Well, it looks like we're on our own on this one. Barney, or B Bernie. Oh, radio off. Uh oh. Well, it looks like I'm on my own. Bernie, guard the place.
expect. Oh, that was creepy. Keys? Cape? Oh, wait. See, I, I found some sort of supply bag, light camping gear, some clothes, some basics. It was alarmed. I think that's what was making the receiver go haywire. You're okay? It's not a trap or anything? Yeah, I'm fine. But there's, there's also a set of keys here. I don't know why they'd be hidden out here. They say Shoshone National Forest, cave 452. Is that the one in the canyon? <clears throat> yeah, it is. Who the hell took them? Man, what the hell is in that cave? Okay, okay, let's just think. Says the woman with a half a bottle of tequila in her belly. Maybe they're panicking and we're preparing to beat it. The fire has them spooked and we have new walkie-talkies, so we have the upper hand. Yeah, well, it's hard to feel like you have the upper hand when you're standing in the dark in the middle of the woods. Oh. Well, you're back in your tower. Maybe you need a drink, too. I'm not in my tower. I am looking at a man standing in your lookout. And it's not you. Bernie! It is not me. Bernie, I'm coming! I'm going. Bernie! I'm coming! Bernie! Bernie! Bernie, stop him! I'm coming, Bernie! Hold on, buddy! I'm on my way! Bernie! Bernie! Bernie? Uh, Bernie, what is this? I don't know. I just saw a man and he placed that there. I don't know, but maybe you need to talk to Bernie. Bernie, you might have some uh, insights on this. I have no idea. This is none of my problem. Well, of course, you're not being the one followed around. Ugh. That means they still, like, they're still tracking us down, even though we have better walkie-talkies now. I don't think our walkie-talkies are jammed again. I think they literally, like, recorded the audio, like, probably just outside the camp. And that's the case. That means they knew we were there. They didn't do anything about it besides do that recording. Which is very, very interesting. Very, very interesting. And very, very creepy. Right there, next day. We're not even using the compass anymore. Huh. You know, if that, all, if that shit's gonna happen, if I decide to go to a Firewatch Tower and work there, maybe I don't want it anymore. <laughs> I know earlier in the series, I was like, you know, it's nice, you get to get back or relax, you don't get to do much unless you're told to, and, you know, it's all nice and good. But then you have creeps like that, and, uh, yeah. <laughs> then you're like, uh, maybe it's not great. Then you have a lot to worry about.
stick together. Okay? Keep our story straight. From the first day with those girls to the person breaking in on our conversation, everything. We just, we gotta be honest and consistent. All right. So, v Bernie, I'm trusting you to guard this place. Can you do that? Yes, I can do that. It seems like there's a lot going on with you two. I will make sure I guard this place with my life. Even if I have to kill some people. All right, you, you, all right, you got this, Bernie. Good, good on you. All right. I'll, I'll see you when I get back, Bernie. Okay. Have fun. <laughs> Uh, yeah, YouTube, uh, Bernie. If I can turn properly, there we go. Alright, so off we go to the caves. If I can turn to the, like, right. Alright. Uh, actually, it would be, actually, it's easier to get to the cave from the shed, which is someone's favorite spot. <coughs> Forest Bernie. Alright, over here. Yeah, this is like literally an easier way and faster way to uh, the cave, so we can go down there. Wee! <clears throat> Wee! <clears throat> off to the cave, off to a cave, we're going to a cave, yes we are. Yeah, we're we're in this together. And Forrest Bernie, even though he has nothing to do with it. I find a report that says something about Forrest Bernie. <gasps> They're after my boy. <clears throat> also, I'm just I'm trying to clear my throat there. <clears throat> Don't know what's up with that. Anyways, oh, I was gonna I was gonna start banging. Oh well. Oh, I still can't. Damn you guys. Good. Nah. Alright, well, in the cave we go. Oh, actually, I think I remember what happened. There was cave in there a second ago, and now it's nothing. I think someone locked me in. Let me out! Help! Help! I'm trapped in a cave! Damn it, they're still following us. Maybe they did maybe they did hack our walkies again. Jesus, this is a big cave. If you could say that again. Okay, not much here, so it looks like I have to go down. Long steep. Oh wait, hold on. Uh can if I can move my camera to the right, please. Jesus Christ. Long steep. Is there a way around? Is there? Can I go anywhere here? Oh. Squeeze through. <laughs> Don't mind me. A spooky, scary cave in. I don't know what's happening. People. Well, it's uh, echoey in here, too. Apparently. Hello? Delilah? <laughs> no? Oh. 
that blood? I definitely see blood down there. That is something red at least. I don't know. I like how I'm not like finding this weird. Interesting. Onwards through the cave. Oh. Oh, I saw the light for a second. No! Well, I mean, I see... Wait, can I connect? Come on, I'm somewhat outside. No way, I don't want to leave the cave. There was... There's gotta be a way that I can... Uh, because I think there was something in here that I can find. I want to look around a bit more in the cave. I don't know, maybe I can enter back into the cave when I can, but like, I don't know. It just seems suspicious, you know? But I don't know, I didn't really see anything else I could interact with, though, that's the thing. Like, down here is the only other thing, and I... All I see is that, and I'm not reporting anything about that. Eh, you know what? I'm sure we're just gonna get acquainted with that later anyway, so, you know. For now, I guess we'll just continue on. I'm sure it's good. Maybe I climb through more caves later. Who knows? Oh, it's still the wave receiver. Come on, I was only gone for a minute. Long drop down, so I can't go back right now. Hey, hey, are you there? Nothing yet, because someone tried to trap me in there. You saw someone? No, someone slammed the gate behind me and then ran away. I found another way out, but if I hadn't... Jesus. So, so you didn't find anything? No. There, there's a spot where someone had sunk an anchor, but the hardware's gone now. I don't have any climbing equipment. I just have my rope. I'm going to hike back to Two Forks and see if I can find anything that could double as an anchor to use in the spot. That doesn't sound dangerous. Two forks. And where do I go for that? Also looks like a bit of a sandstorm kind of brewing. Where am I? Well, that's where the cave was. Uh, how do I get back to two forks from here? Good question. I have no idea. <laughs> Well, aren't we just lost? Unless I can climb this, no. Is this the way we need to go? Up here? Mm -hmm. I just found an outcropping that someone was using as a little fort. I think it was Brian Goodwin. Really? Yeah, he built himself a real castle. Yeah. Wily Coyote stuff, I'll tell you that much. Um, Brian was doing a science fair project oh. about bouncing radio waves off of a meteor shower. Poor kid left his homework? Yeah. He must have been pretty smart, huh? Yeah, sharper than a lot of the grown up knuckleheads I'm used to, yeah. Yeah, but not smarter than yours truly, right? I'm just saying, I'm pretty, uh, you know, with it. I'm a pretty bright bulb. Yeah, Henry, you're a regular Rhodes Scholar. Thanks. I found an old school folder. Brian was a hell of a doodler. It's a little weird that he just 
leave so much of his stuff out here? Well, maybe they were in a hurry when they left. Like I said, he wasn't supposed to be out here. Yeah. I... They almost got busted. Brian liked to go out on the railing of the tower and wave at the planes that dumped water on fires, and... I got a call because someone thought a kid was up in two forks. I lied. And just said it was Ned. If I ratted him out, they would have been forced to leave, and... I don't know, I guess I just felt like I was saving him from whatever shitty life Ned was going to bring him back to. Not that it ended up mattering. And he was in the middle of really sprucing up the joint when they left. Oh, I thought I could report that. A bunch of rocks stacked up. You made a wall and a perimeter. God. Yeah, that's that's perfect. You know, maybe he made it because he was afraid of them. Whenever I think of Brian possibly going through this crap, I get I get sick to my stomach. Yeah. Uh, sorry. Interesting. All right. Well, I guess it's time to. And out then. Oh, well, uh. Is there something else in here I need to find? What's this? Hmm. Bird's nest. Is that a wire? Let's buy some of the wire poles. I definitely can't climb down here. Well, these are just the uh, notes and documents I had before. Interesting. There's gotta be something else around here I can use. It's like... Wait. Nope. I can turn my camera to the right. Yeah, it looks safe. I can jump right. Uh, oh, well, I guess I'll just read this. Dear Ranger, hi, my name is Brian Goodwin. If you found this note, it should be a bunch of climbing anchors. I hope, uh, I hope. Uh, could you do me a favor and please return them, uh, to me, uh, Brian Goodwin, in the mail? My address is 55 Fox Road Lane North, uh, Play New Barswick. Uh, if you tell me your name and address, I will give you... A a reward for this. You were probably wondering why I left these here. Well, uh, they're my dad's. Um, and I don't want him to lose them, but I don't want to do any more climbing on this trip, so I thought I should pretend to lose, lose them. But if you help me get them back, everyone will be happy. Thank you for your time. Uh, thank you, Ranger. Brian. P.S. This reward will be good. Grade A dork contraband here. You found a pocket protector? I found a, uh, I guess, a 
the data sheet for one Gladius Silva, half elf armor seven. Uh, I'm still looking through this. Is he playing Dungeons and Dragons up here? Classic wizards and wyverns. There's a ham radio schematic here, something Brian was working on. There's also a postcard here from Brian to, I guess, his neighbor. And it reads, I'm with my dad, Lander W.Y. Uh, it's pretty neat. Dad fishing in a spot called Sink Canyon. Most of the woman, uh, woman looks like a woman. I guess he wasn't good with spelling. <laughs> uh, most of the woman look like home in Nebraska, but then there are mountains and woods where you can go far. Uh, I'm sorry I can't uh, mow your lawn. I can't mow your lawn this summer, but I hope you find a good person to do it instead. Can you write back and tell my dad when school starts? Because I don't think he knows. Your good friend and neighbor, Brian Goodwin. Well, what's it say? That he's with his dad and sorry he can't mow his lawn this summer. Oh, gosh. And also, he was worried his dad didn't know when school started. So that's where my pillow went. That bastard! There we go. I don't know why I always have to look backwards. Let's see. Yeah, you can say that again. Also, uh, I'm gonna end things here because we are practically out of time in this video already, and I don't know where I'm heading, so uh, yeah, that's also gonna be something I'm gonna have to figure out. No, we're ending the video. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you dudes in the next video. See you dudes next time. Oh no. Hunter! Wait, what? Ah, oh, great. Oh, I get- oh my god. Oh god. Oh jeez. I think we kind of steal faces again. Can I even use them without their faces?